Hello, I am Dr. Manoj Sharma, Director of Mayang Aquaculture Private Limited. Mayang Aquaculture Private Limited is the company who is uh, in the business of shrimp farming. Aquaculture is the rearing of aquatic animals for food and profit. And we are doing it from last uh, 2005, almost a decade, growing shrimps uh, into our ponds which uh, in the old Padta Luka of District Surat. In 1994, I did my master's degree in aquaculture management from Central Institute of Fisheries Education, Mumbai. And I came to Surat with 500 rupees money in my pocket uh, from the scholarship. Here, the aquaculture development was zero. Nobody was knowing the potential of shrimp farming. I was running around the whole villages, meeting the people, the sarpanches of the village, convincing, convincing them to how to start the shrimp farming. And that idea clicked uh, in the village Dandi when I met uh, Pradeep Navik, is one of the visionary Sarpanch. And he gave me a chance uh, with four ponds. And the success of this four pond and the attraction and the, 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 the profitability of this business, which is actually generating from a wasteland from the coastal area, has given an immense hope and spark uh, to the local fishermen community. And from 1994, from four ponds to today, 4,500 ponds have been constructed in the area and with 40,000 rupees turnover, last year we have produced more than 200 crore shrimp in this area. Basic uh, problem uh, during my struggle period was the awareness. Nobody was knowing the uh, aquaculture is also a part of agriculture and shrimps can be grown in the pond. So convincing them that shrimps can be grown in your wasteland which is totally affected by salt was a big challenge. So I did a small demonstration of four ponds in 1995-96 and shown people the power of shrimp farming that it can be uh, done in the coastal area like an agriculture, like a, on the platform of agriculture. So seed, feed, everything was required for the same uh, platform like agriculture. And when we have shown them the immense success compared to uh, the cash crops like sugar cane, banana, compared to that, when people have seen that a lakh or two lakh rupees can be generated from one acre of shrimp pond. So that has really transformed the lives of million in the coastal areas of whole part. Mayang Aquaculture Private Limited was uh, initiated in 2005 uh, to impart technical know-how to the uh, Surat-based farmers. Then slowly uh, we have also started our own farm in 2006 uh, with 10 hectare. And today we have developed more than 50 hectare for our own. In 2011 and 13, even Mayank Aquaculture Private Limited has signed an MOU with Gujarat government to establish 500 hectare shrimp farm. In coming time, uh, I am very keen to start our own processing plant to support the development of uh, uh, shrimp farming industry and to also uh, develop a state-of-the-art export house to help the farmers. Shrimp farming is related to Blue Revolution because Blue Revolution is the development of water. Shrimp farming has a very uh, big impact on the rural economy, especially the coastal fishers, as it is uh, converting the wasteland into the best. Shrimp farming is generating employment to the rural folks, providing uh, nutritional security, food security, as well as employment opportunity right in front of their doorstep. The biggest thing I will tell you, uh, from villages, from rural, people going to urban areas for their livelihood and for their employment opportunity. Whereas, shrimp farming has a power for the reverse migration. People are now moving from cities to coastal areas to become a part of this blue revolution. This is the very biggest impact uh, for the coastal development. Second thing, per hectare, if you see the per hectare uh, mandates generated in agriculture, Maximum mandate generated is 180 to 190 days, whereas in aquaculture per hectare the mandate generated, the labor generated is more than 750 uh, mandates per uh, year. So it has a very uh, big uh, impact on the rural economy. The positive impact of uh, shrimp farming development in the coastal region can be termed uh, or can be related into five major development because coastal is a wastewater. The land entire is a saline affected land and it is developed uh, for the very lucrative to shrimp farming. Second, it's a, it is a doorstep, local uh, employment generation. Third, nutritional standard, the food safety. The whole world is uh, worried about who will feed the uh, world beyond 2050. So aquaculture has the power and uh, future to feed the world beyond 2050. 
the major benefits of shrimp farming in the coastal area is that coastally coastal lands are generally affected with uh, saline so it is only used for salt so these salt affected lands are converted into best productive shrimp ponds plus it's providing the livelihood up, uh, opportunity and the employment uh, opportunity right on the doorstep of the coastal people they don't don't need to go to uh, cities for work uh, for their survival now the impact of shrimp farming and the economic benefits of shrimp farming has attracted so many people from the urban areas so they are now going back to rural area uh, to establish their shrimp farms and earn from shrimp farming the major benefit of shrimp farming is conversion of saline affected waste land into best productive business employment opportunity right in front of the doorstep third is the nutritional safety and the food safety fourth and the biggest is the rivers migration people have immensely attracted to shrimp farming and all educated unemployed people from the urban area are migrating to the coastal villages to get involved into the activity of shrimp farming shrimp farming majorly started with four ponds uh, in the village dandi in the year 1995-96 and the first harvest and the, the spark in the eyes of the villagers has attracted or given them hope to join this business and the business what we started with four ponds in 1997 today it has the area has been developed in more than 5000 uh, ponds and generating a, a turnover of 1200 crore rupees this business has given an opportunity direct employment opportunity to more than 10000 people and indirect opportunity to more more than 50000 people who are engaged into this activity shrimp farming has really brought a tremendous change in the coastal area generally coastal areas are not properly linked with the infrastructure in the form of potable water or the electricity or the road connectivity since shrimp farm has gained an immense space in last 10 years all the 2025 local villages of olpad taluka has now has a greater connectivity by the roads they have very good electricity because all the modern shrimp farm farms requires electricity to run aerators to run water pumps plus it is also given an 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 equal opportunity for the rural employment and labor welfare the sustainable uh, shrimp farming development as gujarat has brought a lot of recognition to me in 1995 uh, i have uh, received the certificate of appreciation for the state government even uh, the prestigious hiralal choudhury best fish farmer award was felicitated to me even uh, the bhumi nirman award was conferred to me by governor of uh, madhya pradesh shri balram singh ji jakhad and even uh, the the success and the success rate and the sustainability in gujarat has even attracted lot of foreign universities and mega uh, uh, shrimp farming and aquaculture shows they invite me as a guest lecturer uh, to to uh, talk about the success story of gujarat in, in the international arena Gujarat has the second largest brackish water holding land suitable for the development of shrimp ponds. It is more than 3,75,000 hectares. The present development is only 1.5% and the annual turnover is 1,200 crore. If next 10 years, if 50% of this area is developed, it can give a direct employment to 2 lakh people and indirect livelihood to more than 10 lakh people. This shrimp farming development is not only restricted to Gujarat state. Now it has become a multi-state affair. since uh, it is also providing uh, 5000 uh, uria people uh, a skill uh, uh, opportunity to work in shrimp ponds this river tapi has a very big importance in my life uh, during the initial uh, phase of 1994 when i landed to surat there was no shrimp ponds and my only survival and hope was this river since lot of fisher men from this area used to collect uh, the rosenberg fresh water prawn seed and they used to uh, call me for the genuinity and purity of seed i used to show them which seed is the good and for every day they used to give me 2 to 300 rupees and that's how i have, I have taken out 2 3 years the secret of my success is simplifying the shrimp farming technology so a common man can also grow it simply